I, we're here in our peanut butter and jelly studio for the five minute peanut butter and jelly challenge. Hugh Atchison's gonna make his 100% best peanut butter and jelly sandwich you can make with all of these ingredients. All the while, while I'm giving quick fire questions. Hugh, are you ready? I'm ready. Let me set the timer. Ready? Yep. Go. It's going for bread already. All right, Hugh. Sriracha or Cholula? Cholula. All right. Bacon or sausage? Bacon. Chicken oyster or real oyster? Let me rephrase that. Rocky Mountain oyster or real oyster? Rocky Mountain oyster is a ball. That's, <laughs> That's a... what I'm talking about. You don't like people's nuts? Chicken oysters are great. <laughs> uh, real oyster. Real oyster. Prosciutto or country ham? Country ham. Spoken from a true Canadian southerner. Ribeye or filet mignon? Ribeye. Ribeye. Are you kidding me? Reaching for creamy pint of peanut butter, I see. Texture's gonna come creamy in. Creamy or way. crunchy? Creamy. Obviously. Okay, fair enough. Fondue or queso? Queso. Queso. Atta boy. What the hell jam selection is this? That's that's there's no blackberry. There's no blackberry here. Hey, it's not that kind of show where we have black stuff, <laughs> white stuff, okay? Pellegrino or Topo Chico? Topo Chico. Negroni or paper plane? Negroni. What is a paper plane? It's kind of like a Negroni. <laughs> <laughs> so he puts the jam on one piece of bread and the peanut butter on the other. Oh, he's going triple. We're going triple. I didn't know this. I know. Burger or hot dog? Uh, hot dog. Really? Gonna go weird on that one. Interesting. Where's that from? There. Reuben or Cuban? Cuban. Cuban. This is a, good, it's a very important question. Mesquite or hickory? Mesquite. Why? Uh, just the flavor profile is better. Cooler. All right. So you got you got I like the half and half on one piece of bread, jam on the other piece of bread. Oh, and he's going for the Lay's potato chips, ladies and gentlemen. Instead of crunchy, we're going for crunch from potato. Potato crunch instead of peanut crunch. But none of that other sweet shit. You got enough sweet, sweet stuff shit. in here. I got it. Texas or Tennessee? Georgia. That's ridiculous. It's not an answer. Try again. Texas or Tennessee? Uh, I gotta go for Texas. Attaboy. We don't play them in football. <laughs> so the la what was the last gala that you went to? Like like a, 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 a awards banquet, gala, something you had to go to where there's like more than 200 people sitting down for dinner. The Emmys? Did you have dinner there? Afterwards? Afterwards. How was it? How yeah. It was okay. So let's talk about catered dinners real quick. We all know it's going to be a choice of three things, right? Can you name those three things that can be at any catered dinner you go to? We can name the three things? Yeah. What do you think it'd be? What do you always think it's going to be at that dinner? It's going to be filet mignon. There you go. Or? Uh, really, like, blitzed salmon. Yes. <laughs> And then a vegetable plate that comes out 25 minutes after everyone else's food That's is how alive. you do it. Okay, now is it going to be mashed potatoes or rice pilaf? Because obviously it's one of those, right? It's going to be mashed potatoes with the beef, rice pilaf with the salmon. <laughs> That's and <laughs> asparagus, <laughs> but in January. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> exactly. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Who would you want to compete with in a cooking throwdown? This is look, look at the garnish action. Um. Who would I want to compete with in a cooking showdown? I don't know, anybody? I don't care. Anyone. You guy's confident. Whatever. I like it. Jonathan Waxman. Waxman. Not in jokes, though. His jokes were... It's pretty good. Oh, no. <laughs> Go ahead. Tequila or mezcal? Mezcal. That's all I got for you. All right, let's go through your sandwich. That's pretty good, by it's the way. Garnished. I garnished the table, too. Four minutes? Let's talk about the sandwich. Two minutes ago. Let's talk about the sandwich. Talk about that. Strawberry jam. Uh huh. Creamy peanut butter. Potato chips. Tri layer. Hawaiian bread. I'm gonna go for it. I like the chip on top. The chip on top is extra garnish. The chips are the Spanish influence. Is that what it is? Yeah. Well, it's originally a Spanish dish, peanut butter and jelly. I feel like it's doing a dance in my mouth right there. It's, but there it's called. Uh, bailar. Bailar. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I can't come up with peanut. What the fuck is peanut in Spanish? I don't know. I got a day. Cacahuete. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, 
the peanut butter, Hawaiian roll, jam and potato chip, triple layer club sandwich. Very first one ever on Love Bites. And I can say, it ain't bad. But it, if, if the kids are taking it to school, they need tequila too. Right, so when you pack this lunch, the last and final thing you put into it is a shot. Thanks you, appreciate you being on Love Bites.